Zombie crabs. Zombie crabs. Hey guys, I'm Alex Farnham and this is Animalist News. All those people constantly preparing for a zombie apocalypse might have the right idea. Don't worry, there's no undead humans yet, but there are hordes of zombie crabs. So barnacles are all over the ocean, but not all of them are simply content sitting on a rock. A special order of barnacles called Rhizocephala survive by stealing the body and mind of other creatures. Ooh, cool. Female parasites find the weakest part of a crab shell and insert themselves into the bloodstream. Using root-like appendages, rhizocephala take over a crab's organs and brain. If the poor victim is a male, she will make him feminine by castrating and widening his abdomen. After that, she sticks her reproductive organ outside the crab's abdomen and waits for a mate. Once the barnacle is fertilized, she makes the crab believe that these are its own eggs. As if that wasn't bad enough, the crab nurses, cleans, and protects what it thinks are its young and eventually helps them find a new host crab to control. But hey, I guess a bunch of feminine crabs are better than a group of zombies trying to eat your brain, right? <laughs> How would you defend yourself during a zombie apocalypse? Let me know in the comments below. Make sure to subscribe here if you're not already. And we're almost at 200,000 subs, everyone. If y'all just got one person to sub right now, we'd be past that number. I'm serious. You know you got your friend or stalkers ready to read whatever you put up on your Facebook, so why not share this story about parasite crabs, right? <laughs> All right, guys, be sure to check out these other videos over here. Here, and I'll see you hairy mammals later. <laughs>